Learn the identities of one man and three children killed in a house fire in the Bronx. Investigators are still trying to determine what caused the tragic fire. CBS 2's Natalie Dudridge is live in Castle Hill with the very latest for us. Natalie. Chris and Mary, a lot of heaviness here in the community. The fire marshal's office is still on the scene investigating. Now I want to show you the first floor roof where you see all that debris there. That's where neighbors tell us they saw at least two people leap down to safety. It has now been a day since this tragedy. The community is shifting from shock into how they can support the surviving family members. Heartbroken because I'm a mother of four. I'm a mother of four and just to hear that a 10-month-old 10, 12, it's heartbroken. A neighbor stops to pay her respects at a memorial, four candles honoring the lives lost. Police have now identified the family members killed as 22-year-old Ahmed Saleh and his 10-month-old baby girl, Bara Saleh, as well as his two younger brothers, 12-year-old Mohammed Walid Ahmed and 10-year-old Khalid Walid Ban Saleh. I would just see them, the kids, when we'll come from school at 2.30 or 3, we'll pass by, they'll see each other with my kids, they'll play and talk. The fire broke out 6 a.m. Sunday at 2165 Quimby Avenue. Hey, I thought my, it was in my house, so I'm smelling the smoke. I jumped up, I started banging everybody's door in my house. There's smoke, smoke, smoke. When I went to my daughter's room, it wasn't her room. We looked out the window, it was black. It was smoke all over. Security camera from across the street captured the panic screams for help. Peep through the window, the hands banging at the window. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank God. After that, for like a minute, the flame burst through the window. You can also see firefighters on the scene trying to rescue trapped family members. Police say a 21-year-old woman and a 41-year-old man were pulled out in critical condition. They're still fighting for their lives in the hospital. The FDNY was set up on the corner this morning handing out free smoke detectors. We're here to educate people, teach them about the do's and the don'ts. You can call the Red Cross, 877 Red Cross. They will come to your house, see what you need and install what you need absolutely free. Community members have also been arriving with supplies. We're here to help. If the parents or families who are who have survived need anything, we're here to see if they need toiletries, if they need blankets, whatever they need. There is still no official word on what caused the fire or if there were fire alarms in the home. Now a safety awareness campaign is being planned across the borough. We are live in the Bronx. Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News. Natalie, thank you. Now